Comrades, Havals, Guerrillas, I bring a message of resistance, rebellion and revolution. This is a song for the Queen of England. I am not your subject, I am not a slave. is not the Middle Age In the land of lords and ladies and knights of the realm I reject your aristocracy and your monarchy as well And I think you should take off those pantomime costumes If you want to survive the revolution I say now's the best time to go You don't own the beaches and you don't own the swamp Stand against me in the courtroom and you don't bring to resign. You're just a burden on the people who you've always oppressed. Hang around another few years and you'll see what comes next. And I think you should take off those hands of mine costumes. And dismantle your fairy tale flower. If you want to survive the revolution, I'd say now's the best time to go. Cause we will not take this much longer. The resistance is getting stronger. is getting stronger Everybody, cheers for tuning in. Um, I've actually pre-recorded this. You're watching this live on Facebook on Wednesday night. I pre-recorded this on the Tuesday night simply because, uh, well, this looks much cooler than my bedroom. Um, also, uh, I'm trying to raise a bit of cash with this gig. 
because I'm homeless and a few guys told him. <laughs> uh, so there's a PayPal link um, alongside this video and if you think about chucking a couple of quid in that would be great. This one's called Nothing to Lose But Our Chains. Nationalism, millions of comrades standing as one. Now's the time to smash the system so we can build a new world. Cause we've nothing to lose but our chains. So we'll fight through the days that remain. And we're willing to lay down our lives if that's what it takes. We've nothing to lose but our chains. demands will not go unheard. We'll put an end to these capitalists before they swallow up our world. So go join the workers' collectives, find a union and raise your voice. Stand on the front lines with your comrades behind, overthrow the system and rejoice. Cause we've nothing to lose but our children. So we'll fight through the days that remain And we're willing to lay down our lives If that's what it takes We've nothing to lose but our chains In India and in Uganda In Turkey and in Vietnam From the Punjab down to Nepal We have no fear, we smile and cheer as we knock down their border walls To let the prisoners out of their cages Tell their loved ones that families are free The time has come to disarm the bombs for the sake of all humanity Cause we've nothing to lose but our chains so we'll fight through the days that remain And we're willing to lay down our lives If that's what it takes We've nothing to lose but our chance So, just get in tune. This next song is um, Call the Volunteers and it's for all the British lads who've been out of that in northern Syria fighting with the YPG. Uh, if I remember who it starts, here we go. This one goes out for Eric, Luke, Dean, and Jack, and all the other volunteers who didn't make it back May the world always remember The selfless things they did Like a candle in their on a launch campaign To never quit And no matter what the papers say Don't believe a word To call these boys anything but heroes is absurd 
They could have stayed at home and remained sat here today, but they followed in the footsteps of the international game. When the government fell silent, the politicians hid away, and our boys saw on Facebook how Syria decay. Each one had its reasons for joining in the fight, for standing by the curtain, going straight to the front line. So no matter what the people say, don't believe the word To call these boys anything but heroes is absurd They could have stayed at home and been sat here today But they followed in the footsteps of the international again And history will show how they tried to right the wrong out for the martyrs, the ones who fell Shaheed, for everyone who knew them and all their families. Be strong and be proud of what your loved ones achieved. They faced off with the devil and put him down to his knees. So no matter what the papers say, don't believe a word. To call these boys anything but heroes is absurd. They could have stayed at home and been sat here today. This next one's uh, called Yazidi, and uh, if anybody out there doesn't know, this is about the Yazidi genocide. There's still an estimated three to ten thousand Yazidi women uh, being held in captivity by Turkish stroke ISIS fighters. Um, and hopefully this all this song will help to um, draw a bit of attention to that.
yet. Okay. <clears throat> if you uh, if you actually if you listen to my album, there's another there's another verse to that song, but uh, that's sung by a, a great singer called Five Bag Moves, not here, so I won't uh, ruin it by singing it myself. Um, okay. This one's called uh, Ending This Love Affair with the British Empire. And if I can remember the lyrics, it's quite good. This song was written by uh, my favourite songwriter in the world and a friend of mine, Mr. David Ravix, um, and uh, it's called St. Patrick Battalion. Decided to rise to the cold. The front 
Dublin City to San Diego We witness freedom denied So we fought St. Patrick Italia And we fought on the Mexican side Oh, we fought for St. Patrick Italia And we fought on the Mexican side Under the green flag of St. Patrick Emblazoned with Eringo Bra Bright with the harp and the shamrock And the retired para Mexicana Just fifty years after Wolf Tone Five thousand miles away The Yanks called us a legion of strangers But they can talk as they may From Dublin City to San Diego We witness freedom denied so we fought the St. Patrick Battalion And we fought on the Mexican side Oh, we fought the St. Patrick Battalion And we fought on the Mexican side We fought them in five major battles Chiribusco was the last Maimed by the cannons from Boston We fell after each mortar blast most of us died on that hillside In service to the Mexican state So far from our occupied homeland We were heroes and victims of fate From Dublin City to San Diego We witnessed freedom denied So we formed the St. Patrick Battalion And we fought on the Mexican side From Dublin City to San Diego Okay, uh, this next one is uh, a song for, about and dedicated to the uh, all-female Kurdish militias fighting ISIS right now. This is, uh, this one's called Song for the YPJ.
departed homelands They fought alongside allies in a war against Saddam The liberators of Rojava, those brave women and men Some gave their lives for freedom and they do it all again So I sing today for the YPJ in solidarity with those in Kurdistan there's martyrs there from almost everywhere They come from far and wide to lend a hand If only everyone could understand The revolution rests in their loving hand Well then, this is, um, this is the only non-political song uh, I'm playing today, but this is about losing somebody to a drug addiction, so seems to be quite commonplace these days, maybe some of you will relate. I once met an angel with tattered broken wings I saw her fall down from the sky, I heard the violins She asked me if I'd pick her up and help her to recover but we both knew that what she meant was would I be her lover So I reached down, held out my hand, lifted her to her feet As our eyes met we both began to go weak at the knees She whispered something sweet and then I held her in my arms I knew heaven must have been real and it didn't feel that far but even when it's written in the stars, anyone can fall apart I fixed her wings and made that halo shine, then she flew away with my heart Long blonde hair and a pretty face, she smelled so heavenly But songbirds aren't meant to be caged, she needed to be free I like to think that sometimes she looks down from above And guards me from the darker side, stops me giving up But even when it's written in the stars, anyone can fall apart I fixed her wings and made that halo shine, then she flew away with my heart Seventh seal will break and the book will open up so I can see the second coming of the only one I ever really loved. And even when it's written in the stars, anyone can fall apart. I fixed her wings and made that halo shine Then she flew away with my heart Okay um. This song I wrote this about different fascists throughout history, um, including Erdogan, who's the leader of Turkey at the moment. came my life forever 
were changed They rounded up my village and they put us on a train Into the night we rode In dirty sodden clothes I saw the rifle butt descending as the bastards broke my nose came, I travelled down to Spain, risked everything I had in the international brigades, landed in Madrid, when Franco ran and hid, I killed 50 men with my bayonet, but the monsters wouldn't quit. came, they lit the right stack up in flames, and the SS began purging anyone with half a brain, with help from overseas, we brought the Fuhrer to his knees, and swore never again to allow the spread of this disease, when the fascists came, they started marching once again, burning swastikas in Georgia as the world looked on in shame, and in the desert land, as Turkey moves its hand, another mini Hitler with imperialist plans. This next song um, about one of my heroes who I actually got to meet before he passed away. I think it was last year, it might have been the year before. Um, Mr. Howard Marks, the coolest man who ever came from Wales. Everyone is a hero, and Howard was mine. He flaunted the law and he time for a cause he believed in, saw through all the lies, so I'm liking one last joint to Howard's demise. Entrepreneur recruited as a spy, wanted by agents of the FBI, 43 passports always fucking high, known to his closest friends as Mr. Knight. of Afghanistan, sticky black tar and a roach in his hand, smuggling into Shannon thanks to Jim McCann. Taken from Spain and then locked in a cell, they couldn't break him in that old living hell, he kept his head and helped others as well, the cracker from Wales with a story to tell. Saw through all the lies, 
So I'm liking one last joint to Howard's tonight. I'm liking one last joint to Howard's tonight. I'm liking one last joint to Howard's tonight. I hope you like that one anyway. So. I don't know if anybody else is getting sick of Theresa May. But I am. And hopefully. I mean, I'm not much of a Labour person since Tony Blair. But, uh, Hopefully Corbyn will make some sort of difference. Huh? I'm certainly going to vote for him myself. Just to give May a kick in the teeth. Okay, this one's called Goodbye Teresa. This one's called uh, The Government's Trying to Kill Me. Oh, the government's trying to kill me, they're shutting down the NHS. Only the rich can't afford healthcare, and they don't care about the rest. They're privatising everything, yes, you know it's true. That the government's trying to kill me, and they're trying Taking 
jobs away. These zero hour contracts just don't bring home the pay. There's no food on the table, it's more than just bad luck. Oh, the government's trying to kill me, but I don't give a fuck. Yeah. I mean, it's sad, really, isn't it? But <laughs> this is the start of the country right now. Okay, so this next song, um, every time I put this on YouTube, it gets removed. Um, it's been removed off Facebook a few times, even though there's there's nothing wrong with this song. This song tells the story of the imprisoned Kurdish leader Abdul Arsalan and it tells um, his life story up until he landed in prison in 1997-1998. So if there's no other reason to share this video far and wide, make sure you do it just because of this song because uh, it's been censored everywhere. They are free. He's a gorilla in the greatest sense, a revolutionary. And he took up arms in '84 to fight the Turkish state and protect the Kurdish people from another deadly fate. Some may call him a terrorist, but you know it's not that way. And when politicians didn't care, he formed the PKK. Up in the mountains, launched attacks against the state for their years of persecution and their policies of hate. On a mission for the freedom of the people of his land, he's the life and blood and heart and soul of all of Kurdistan. He liberated women, helped them shed religion's chains, built a path for every person from the cradle to the grave. An intellect and passion like the world has rarely seen. He's a leader without privilege, and I think that we should free. him in Italy, then sent him on his way. No other European state would sign off on his plane, so he ended up in Kenya where he was finally betrayed. By the hidden hand of the Secret Service and the CIA, they shipped him back to Turkey in a big public display, called the media and film crews before they locked him away. Held a puppet trial, they had their death sentence overturned. If they'd only take another look, I think that they could learn. Thanks for listening. I hope um, you've enjoyed it. And uh, please remember that there's a PayPal link, uh, probably above or in the comments of this video. Um, if you want to chuck a few quid in the app and help keep a roof I've made, that'd be nice. Um, if you've got money and you want to. 
Um, okay, so this is my song, and this is I'm an anarcho communist. I believe in workers' control of the means of production. This wage slavery is no better than destitution. I want to see the disbanding of all nations. And light up my newly legalized weed in a chalice And the workers all around the world, they can breathe sighs of relief Cause we put an end to tyranny and save the Middle East Away, 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 more shots away. 